Hey everybody, Growth Coach Greg with the Healthy, Wealthy, and Wise Coaching Program. Your future is dependent on two things. It's on your willingness to create a future or your unwillingness to create a future. So your unwillingness to create a future will result in doing the same things that you did in the past because you're wired to live on a familiar future and a or a known future and a familiar past to repeat that same process because that's efficient that is safe your brain strives and runs primarily on efficiency on safety and on comfort it doesn't like the unknown but if you want to create a future that is your property where do you create it from you create it from the unknown the reality is, is that we are only here on a three-day pass. So that three-day pass is that next day is your choice. That future is your choice. As much as the present is your choice. You get to decide what stories you want to continue to play out. You get to decide whose ideas of you, whose beliefs of you. You get to decide what people thought of you as yours or not yours. You get to decide what you move forward with. The most important thing is that you recognize and become, in the first place, aware of all of the things that have brought you to be who you are today or who you believe you are today. You have to keep moving forward. And sometimes doing that requires going back in your life and peeling back the layers. Our brains have stored everything. We are basically a, a body of memories. And those memories and the meaning we attach to them are what serve us or what do not serve us. And they become who we are. Or again, at least who we think we are. The ego, so the my of life, the ego. Versus the self of life, which is that purity, that just being person. All this to say is that your future is your property and you have to go back and explore those parts of your life that you've pushed away so deeply. Those memories are there, but are those memories serving you in the present? Are they going to serve you in the future or are you going to create a three-day past that you want to live on, a three-day past that you know you're worthy of deep down?